the World Bank project emphasizes providing more of Jordan's women and youth with income earning activities. The loans are part of a World Bank supported project encouraging more women to start micro, small and medium enterprises in Jordan where such businesses account for 71% of all employment. The project addresses Jordanian people's demands to create jobs. Amina Khadr opened her small Trico factory with a bank loan of around $10,000. صارت اوضاع شوي هيك مكركبة بالبيت صار لازم حد يكون في بالبيت يسند الوضع اللي اشتغلت تقريبا شهر عند واحدة هون ما عجبني الوضع هم مش متعودة اني اشتغل اسمعت انها بدها تبيع اخذت قرض من البنك الانماء الصناعي Aida Mohammed, a divorced woman supporting a young son and his wife, who work with her, has taken a loan to start her business. She prefers to do furniture renovations and paint wood. سمعت عن شركة تمويلكم وحكيت معهم تلفون إجوا زاروا مشاف المشروع طبعا المشروع بالنسبة لهم كان شيء غريب ودعمونا على طول يعني أول يوم تاني يوم كنت ماخذ الشك. Aida got the microloan through a $70 million line of credit provided by the World Bank to the Central Bank of Jordan. Her clients are child care centers, shopping malls and business offices. She would only employ females if needed. Kauthar is the owner of a daycare who employs nine women. She started the daycare business from home till now she has taken a total of four loans. I started my business in the house in the house. I had 13 students, almost. After I finished my business, it was a large number of my business. I took a loan from your company, 400 dinars. I used a little bit in the house. I used a fresh fresh with a television. I used a whole lot from the house. I didn't need to go to the house or anything from the house. When I increased the number, I didn't have a place in the house because my children, I have a number of children. So I decided to get a whole house. I'm going to have a house with a house with a house with a The first loan for 600 JDs, then 800, then 3,000 while the last one was for 7,000 JDs to be paid over 20 months to buy furniture and play toys for the children. Using a loan through the microfund for women, Dunya Shilbaya was able to expand her child center for the disabled. We opened it in 2002. Of course, it was still working. The loan they took through Microfund for Women, which was for 1,000 JDs, helped set up the speech therapy room. And they took 3,000 JDs to buy a bus to reach the poor areas of Sahab and Abu Alanda, two of the poorest regions in Jordan. Followed by 7,000 JD loan to renovate the center interior and buy carpet audio-visual equipment and computers. Naayim, a wife and a mother of three living in Amman. She buys products from Aqaba and sells them in Amman. Five years ago, she decided to buy a minivan to drive young girls to school. She received a number of loans from Tamwilkom. The last one was for 500 JDs. Arij is a married housewife and has two boys and a girl enrolled at school. She studied fashion design in Amman 15 years ago. She started at home with a home-type sewing machine. The micro-loans have turned her small business into a major source of income. I started in 2000, I took a loan from a loan. I bought a small loan and a loan. I started to work in my house in my house. Arij has used her loan to face economic difficulties. Since June 2013, more than 4,500 business loans have been dispersed across the country through banks and NGOs.
The project contributes to achieving universal financial access, where financial inclusion is a catalyst for ending extreme poverty and boosting shared economic prosperity.